Hi guys, I wanted to show you something. Here's my two babies. I'm going to give them a snack. I'll tell you all about the snack. There you go. Nom nom. There you go. Okay. Check out these dogs. <laughs> they love their snacks. Okay. That's Coco and that's Lola. And they love their, <laughs> their snacks. They're so happy when they get them. Okay. So I wanted to show you guys something. These snacks that I gave them. Um, I know this channel is not about dogs, but you know, since I'm all neurotic, like a uh, bodybuilder type lady, okay, I also want my dogs to eat healthy. So I do, do the controversial thing, and I do not feed my dogs commercial uh, food, okay, I don't feed them pellets, I don't feed them anything, I feed them, actually I'm going to change this over to, so you guys can face me, okay, <laughs> so I showed you I, I was feeding my dogs their snack for the day, okay, what I have here is something totally amazing. You can get it at Costco. It's $15 a bag, and um, it's literally freeze-dried chicken breasts, okay? This is what it looks like. See? Freeze-dried chicken breasts, okay? There's no added crap. There's no carbohydrates. There's no fillers. There's no junk in this stuff. It's $15 a bag, and it tells you how many your dogs can have. My dogs are, like, I think up to 15 pounds can get one a day, okay? So there's a, literally a chicken breast that they're eating. I don't know if you guys want me to tell you what I do with my animals because I'm pretty sure it will freak some people out. But um, it, it's like, uh, I think it's because we eat the way we eat. I'll get my smoothie. I'm going to finish my smoothie. The way that we eat, that I think that my, dis my dogs deserve the same as I do, okay? So I don't give them pellets, I don't, uh, when, when we just got the dogs, I started them on um, home-cooked foods, and I would cook for them the vegetables and the meat and all of those things, right? And then I started doing some more research on what's good for dogs, and when we got Coco, which is the mama, we, we got Lola first, and then later on we got Coco, her teeth was in horrible shape. Not that she wasn't taken care of or anything, okay? She just had so much tartar buildup on her teeth, it's not even, it's, it was horrible. I mean, I took her to the vet and the vet said to me, you know, when she got her shots and everything, and he, she said, this dog needs to get her teeth cleaned or she's going to lose them all, okay? Um, and that's when I like, oh my God, because we still got to fix Lola. So it's $350 to get Lola fixed and then it's $350 to get uh, Coco's teeth cleaned and blah, blah, blah. So I did some research and everything and we started feeding our dogs a raw, a raw diet, Okay. Now, I'm telling you, uh, if you guys want to know about raw dieting and everything that we do and how we feed the dogs, I can tell you about it. If it freaks you out, I won't. I know it's not a doggy channel. It's a beauty channel. But I know a lot of people who love makeup also love babies and love puppies. So after we started her on, on the, the both of them on the raw diet, which, by the way, they love. They think they died and gone, gone to heaven, okay? Um, three weeks after uh, uh, starting them on this diet, Coco's teeth, okay, are white as white can be. There's not one little piece of tartar on her teeth left. Nothing. It's cleared up all the way from the top to the bottom. Her gum line is beautiful. Um, it's absolutely amazing. If you guys want me to make a video on that, I will. But I just wanted to show you this for snacks for dogs. Because all the other crap that you buy at the grocery store has all kinds of fillers and carbohydrates in it, people. And dogs do not need carbohydrates, okay? In the wild, they do not eat carbohydrates, okay? So it's all the carbs. Uh, they say, oh, put your dogs on dry food, then they won't get tartar, blah, blah, blah. Well, you know what? My dogs are eating a little bit more expensive food, okay? But I just saved myself $350 to get my bloody dogs' teeth uh, cleaned um, because, you know, they have to put out, put, be put down with anesthetic or whatever to get their teeth done. And it's, anesthetic's not good for the dog, okay? So... People feed their dogs carbohydrates or they think they feed their, their dogs healthy foods because they, they give them the dry foods and the veterinarians say, oh, if you don't give them wet foods, they won't get tartar buildup. She was brought up on pellets, okay, and she had bad teeth. She had the thickest tartar buildup ever, okay. So my dogs have none of that. They will never, ever in their life go to a, a vet again for a teeth cleaning. They will not need anesthetic. Only Lola because she needs to get fixed. But that's it. If you guys want me to talk about that some more, I will. If not, this will be the last video on it. But for you guys who are looking for healthy snacks for your dogs, it's not going to make them fat because it's all protein. Go to Costco. Unfortunately, I threw out the package because it was one of those packages that had the little Ziploc thingy, but it wouldn't seal. And I didn't want the, the stuff to dry out even more and get all gross or whatever, and especially in the humidity. So I ended up taking it out of bags and putting it in Ziploc bags. But it's chicken strips. And you go read the contents. It's 
only chicken. There's no added crap in it, okay? So very healthy snacks for your dogs. If you wanted to, I just thought I would mention it. Okay, guys, have a great day. Bye-bye.